Hey, it is February 2nd. Uh, starting a new month. Well, started it yesterday, but sometimes I'm a little behind the ball on these things. Some interesting things have been happening. I'm sort of re-looking at the beginning of the month, looking back and seeing how am I doing on this whole idea of living a bigger life. And, uh, I'm doing okay, I think. I have got, uh, I'm my, I haven't been weighing myself, but my pants are feeling a little looser, so I'm going to assume that I am uh, getting in better shape. I certainly have a whole lot more energy. My script is moving along nicely. Classes are going well. I'm on top of my marking, mostly. And uh, we have taken possession of the rental property. I am a landlord. Great tenants, met them on the weekend. Uh, really, really sweet people. They are so glad to be there. The rents are at a reasonable market rate for the city they're in. Um, a little low perhaps, but I'm okay with that. Something came up that has echoed resonantly through huge amounts of my life. So. We get an e-transfer for the rent money, and my first instinct is, oh, no, 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 I couldn't take your money. Of course, I took it. If we, if we don't get the rent money, we are going to go bankrupt. Why am I so reluctant to accept money? This is something that has echoed through my entire existence and continues. What is it about that? Why am I so, why is my first instinct when money shows up to go, no, 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 no. I am actively working towards building a bigger life and part of that is certainly financial prosperity. It's not the only thing. I don't even think it's the biggest thing, but it is certainly part of it. I want, I want some more cash coming in. And yet when it comes in, my first instinct is to say, no, 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 you keep that. What's wrong here? I've got this issue around money that I need to resolve if I'm going to live a bigger life. I'm not saying money is the most important thing and I'm certainly not in love with it, but it's part of the picture. There was an interesting episode of Designing Women years ago, of course years ago, the show's been off the air forever, where Suzanne Sugarbaker was uh, one of the women she was working with, and I can't remember who, I think it was the Annie Potts character, was in financial trouble. It was short term, it was a, a, a blip, but she was in trouble for a little bit. And Suzanne Sugarbaker wrote her a check and she wouldn't take it. And she said something interesting. Say, like, we are friends. You will take my time, you will take my love, you will take my commitment, you will let me be there for you, but you won't take my money. You will take all these other things that are so much more important, but you won't take my money. I'm not sure what it is. This is something I need to work out. Why am I reluctant to accept financial prosperity? Why am I reluctant to accept money? My tenant is awesome. She, well, they are, there's a family, they are so glad that they don't have to move. They are so happy living where they are, and they are so happy to pay the rent. This is not a win-lose situation. This is a win-win situation, and yet I am reluctant. I have a meeting with my therapist in a few minutes. Got some stuff to talk to Kathy about. Talk soon. I'll let you know what Kathy says or more likely what Kathy helps me figure out.